Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to remove password log from your Android phone without losing any data. And this method works also on Samsung phone, so you can unlock any Samsung password without losing data. Now this is not factory reset, this is not hard reset, this is a method that unlocks your phone without you losing any of your data. Now don't forget that using factory reset or hard reset you are going to lose your data. So did you unknowingly or mistakenly lock your Android phone and you forgot the password you used to lock the phone? Or did your child or kid mistakenly set a password in your phone and the child cannot remember the password anymore? Also maybe you've not used your phone for a long time and you cannot recall the password you used in locking the phone. In this video, I'll show you how to unlock the phone even if you've forgotten your phone password. So at the end of this video, you'll be able to unlock your phone without losing any of your phone data. Guys, before I proceed, take a moment to like the video and also subscribe to the channel so you get notified whenever I drop a new video like this. And also very importantly, I want to put out this disclaimer notice that the content of this video is strictly for educational purpose and this video is strictly for viewers looking for a solution to unlock their forgotten Android pin without losing their phone data. So let's proceed guys. First you are going to impute this pin. So go to your unlock section and impute this pin 9 2 6 0 3. Tap on enter or ok. Incorrect pin entered. So the next thing you are going to do is to go to the emergency call section and dial this code with me. So make sure you dial the exact code I'm typing. Star. Confirm what you just typed and tap on send or enter. It will tell you that the number you just typed is not an emergency number. So you need to wait for 15 seconds after dialing that and make sure your timer is at least 15 seconds or your timing is at least 15 seconds. So after doing that, you are still going to go to the emergency call section and dial another code. So dial this other code. Confirm what you just typed. And press send. You are still going to get this message that it's not an emergency number. So after that, go to the pin section and impute this 5 digit pin. incorrect pin entered so you need to wait 15 seconds in order for us to enter the last step that will unlock the phone after waiting for minimum 15 seconds go to the emergency call section and you're gonna dial this last code before we unlock our phone so dial this
confirm what you just have uh, make sure it's exactly what I typed confirm what you just typed sorry make sure it's exactly what I typed and press send So after that you need to wait this time at least 20 seconds so guys while you're waiting for minimum 20 seconds in case you did not like the video and subscribe to the channel do well to like the video subscribe to the channel so you'll be notified whenever i drop a new video so if you've waited minimum 20 seconds go to the pin section and impute this pin you're going to type 0 4 802 Press OK. So as you can see the phone has been unlocked. And if you check, we have all our apps and our files entered. None of the files we deleted from our phones. Now you can go ahead and change the password to your desired password. To do that, you need to go to the phone settings. Tap on the phone and go to the settings. I will need to close this. Go to the settings home page. Under the settings, scroll down and select privacy and security. Select lock screen. Impute the pin you use in unlocking the phone. 04802. Continue. So here you can change the lock screen to whichever one you want. If you want to change it to pattern, Draw the pattern if you want to change it to password which is alpha numeric password set it the password also if you want to change to pin now you can see the security level pin has a medium high security while the strongest security level is the alpha numeric password because it contains characters it contains numerals and also contain alphabet so pattern also has a medium security pattern has the lowest security because its security is medium so go ahead and change to the lock screen to whichever option you want and with that you've now secured your phone password thank you guys for watching do well to like the video subscribe to the channel i'll see you in my next video